Hey you guys, it's the Dark Skin Beauty 21. So today I'm coming to you with an initial wig review. Um, I ordered this wig from lacewigsfront.com. This is the Virgin Chinese Light Yaki in 20 inches. It's a full glueless, glueless lace wig. And let's just say that shipping is so fast. You think that it being coming from China that it's gonna take forever to get here, but no. I ordered this like Sunday evening, and today is Tuesday, 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 Tuesday at 11 something, and I just now got the wig, so that was quick. Like, I'm so excited. I didn't even open it yet, and keep watching, guys. Keep watching. So this is the packaging, it came by DHL, and it took like two days. Like I said, I ordered it Sunday um, evening, and I received it like Tuesday morning. Whoopsie, I actually received the wig Wednesday. Today is Wednesday, I'm sorry. Not Tuesday, I received the wig Wednesday. This is what it comes in this bag, April Lacewick Store, high quality, low price, and then you have the website at the bottom. So I'm going to take it out the bag so you can see what the box looks like. This is, this is the box that I see everyone have on YouTube when they take out their thing, April Lace Wigs, you know, yada, 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 nothing fancy about this. Let's see if I can open it. And here is the wig in the packaging. And um, it's very light. So, 20 inches looks pretty long to me. So I'm going to take out the plastic and I'll show you guys. Also, it came with um, a wig cap to match the color of the lace that you chose. So I chose like a brownish colored lace. So this is the wig cap they gave me. I might put it on, but I'm going to try it without the wig cap. So I'm going to compare it. And um, this also came in the box. Um, I guess this is like an information booklet on how to carry your wig. Yada, yada, yada. So, yeah. So this is the wig. 20 inches. I got this. This is the light Chinese virgin. I mean, this is the virgin Chinese light yaki. I got it in a color number two. 20 inches. Full glueless lace wig base. Um, what else? No silk top, just regular. And I'll show you the inside if you can see this. Because I'm using my iPod right now instead of my actual camera. But it has the straps in the back. Oh, you know. Yeah, it has the straps in the back. has clips and combs. Clips and combs. And then, um, straps are, like, right over here. I wish it would focus. There we go straps and combs but I'm probably not going to use the combs because I don't really have much hair to attach it to and that's the construction really um, this is the information for the wig Chinese virgin 20 inches number 2 light yaki uh, cap size small glueless full lace wig so that just the baby hairs and all these things. So I'm going to try it on and then I'm going to show you guys what it looks like. So first I'm going to try it on without the cap. And then if I feel like I need to put the cap on, I'll try it with the cap. So, alright. Okay guys, so this is me with the wig on. Obviously I did not cut the lace off. Um, I did not put a cap underneath it. And this is the 20 inches and that's where it, it lies on me like right underneath my boob on my rib like on my last rib that's where it lies and um this is cool so far my hair is kind of puffy because I didn't you know brush it down hair feels really good like permed hair like everybody says and I like it so far this is a hair it's, it flows pretty nicely Let's see look at that ew but, um, I, um, tightened the straps so it could fit to my head and it feels very secure, like, oh my gosh, I love this. So, um, yeah, these baby hairs, though. The hairline, let me see, the hairline, 
looks, well, I didn't, I need to pull it up further on my head, but it looks fairly decent. And then on the side, they have like the little tab, the bendable tabs, so you could um, shape it to your head. And this side, the hairline is not that bad. Hairline is not too, too bad. If you take up the baby hairs. If I sweep up the baby hairs. But yeah, that's the hairline so far. And I have little sideburns now, so I don't look too, too bald. <laughs> um, but yeah, this is the hair, and I, I really like it so far. And for me, the clips, like, I don't really feel them, so that's good. They're not bothering me. Um... Yeah, the hair is like really soft, so I'm going to part the hair so you guys can see what the parting looks like. Oh yeah, and I asked for bleach knots, and I believe they bleached the knots for me, so I'm going to part it and show you guys. So guys, this is the parting, and yes, they did bleach the knots for me. If anything, you're seeing black stuff, it's probably my hair underneath. I did not put on a cap, so if I were to put on a cap, you wouldn't be seeing all that. Um, the knots are bleached. The only thing I feel like the la the lace looks kind of light. I mean, I ordered a brown lace, and I feel like this is kind of light, but you know that can easily be solved. And I'm trying to part it over here. Looks pretty pretty decent. Um, so. So far, I have no problems with this. Um, I think I'm going to cut off the lights. Let me just do a few more little inspections, and then I will cut off the lace and show you what it looks like. So you know I have to do the putting up the hair in a bun test, which I can. I'm so happy because um, from all the wigs I've had, I was never able to put it up, you know, high in a bun because either I had a full lace wig that wasn't glueless, so if I did that, you know, um, the back wouldn't stay down, or either I had a lace front wig, which was kind of difficult to do with that, so now I have a full glueless lace wig, and I am so happy, like, you don't understand, I am the happiest person in the world right now, like, I am in love with this so far. Um, I will keep you guys updated on how this wig goes, because I haven't really seen much, um, updates on this wig, so I want to add on so I can help somebody, because I really love this so far, like, I even cut the lace off yet, and I'm just like, oh, I just love this, I'm so happy, and, like, they say that it's supposed to resemble, um, permed african-american hair and it does like and i just love how it flows and it, it just bounces like oh, i'm so happy so anyway like i said i'm gonna cut off the lace and then i'm gonna show y'all all right so this is the back of the wig it does not have any lace a couple of people were complaining about it but that's all right if i want to put it up i could just use a headband but the back's all right and um they got little hairs going on over here too. I think they had little baby hairs in the back, but I didn't have them pulled down. Yeah. I know I said I was gonna cut off the lace, but before I do that, I wanna test it to make sure it curls because some people are saying that it wasn't curling and then some people were saying that it was curling. So I'm gonna test it for myself before I cut the lace because if it doesn't curl, then I might have to send it back. Okay. So this is the one little curl that I did. Um, I'm gonna try and do another one. I used the Conair Infinity Curling Wand to do this. It's bouncy. I'm gonna try another one. So this is the other curl that I just did. Curl's pretty decent. And the amount of time that I curled the other one, this one's kinda got a little droopy. Um, I actually didn't hold it on there that long, so maybe that's why. Not sure, but this one's alright. Um, this one's okay. So, yeah, it curls. Does our whole curl? Mm, not sure. But otherwise, I really love the hair so far. I've been running my hands through it, no tangling. 
I only got one strand of hair for shedding. I, mean, I think that's because I put it up in a ponytail and it kind of pulled the ponytail holder out of my head. And that's the reason why. But otherwise, this is very secure. No tangling, no shedding. I love it. And now I'm really going to cut the lace off. So, uh, see you later. So as you can see, I cut off the lace. I'm not the best lace cutter, but I cut it as close as I could without cutting off the hair. See, it's kind of lifting a little bit. I might get some tape to tape that piece down. It's just the little corners and stuff. But otherwise, look at that. It looks pretty darn natural. Yeah, I'm not the best at cutting lace. I don't want to get too close and cut off some of the hair, so that's there. Um, maybe when my mom comes home, she can help me with it, but... Lace all cut off. And I love this wig. I love it so much. Oh my gosh. Um... I really love it. Look at that. Mmm. Mmm. And it just flows. See, look at that. Flow. Flow. Mmm. Anyway, so that's about it. Like I said, no tangling, no shedding. Um, it curls. Um, I might need to, to put, I well, I brush this out, but I might have to put something in there to help hold the curl because it definitely hold curl that well so like I said um got this from lace wigs front glueless full lace wig um Chinese version light yaki even though it's been processed to get that yaki texture 20 inches color number two wig cap size small I said brown lace but whatever um the bleach the the bleach but now it's our bleach, but I realize it's like just really the front section. So, yeah, it's just really the front section. You can part it anywhere because it's a full lace wig, glueless with the straps, the clips, yada yada yada. So, anyway, this is the end of my initial review. I hope I was helpful to someone. And I will try to come back later on with um, an update on this wig. So, yeah, this is the wig, and I love it, I love it, I love it. Alright, so, thanks for watching, you guys, bye!